hello friends welcome back to another video in this video tutorial i will show you how to fix mega bonk game freezing crashing not launching not loading black screen low fps or other issues on pc so let's go through it so the first method is to restart your pc and steam so go to steam and uh, first game, then click on steam option over here then click on exit after that click on windows icon then click on power then select restart so this will restart your system after system restarts now check if the problem is resolved if not next is to verify integrity of game files for that go to steam under library section select your game right click on it click on properties now click on install files and then click on verify integrity of game files so after verifying the game files check if the problem is fixed if not next is to update graphics card for that go to the windows search go to the windows search search for device manager now go below expand display adapter select your graphics card right click on it click on update driver and then click, click on search automatically for drivers so this will check if any update is available and after that try to launch the game nvidia and amd users go through this uh, link that i have already given in the description and you can easily update your graphics card from there next solution is to modify launch option so for that go to steam under library section select your game right click on it click on properties now under general here you need to type minus dx11 and then check if the problem is fixed if not type minus dx12 and then try to launch the game if not type minus d3 d11 and then try to launch the game and see if it's working now if not next is to disable in-game overlay for that go to steam now click on steam option over here then click on settings then go to the in-game and here enable the steam overlay while in game option if it is enabled you have to disable it by clicking on it after that check if the problem is fixed discord overlay users go to the user settings then game overlay tab then switch off enable in game overlay option from here for geforce experience open geforce experience tab on gear icon beside username click on general and switch off in game overlay options from here next is to run game as administrator so for that go to steam under library section select your game right click on it click on manage and click on browse local files and now select the game application right click on it click on properties then click on compatibility and here you need to click on run this program as an administrator then hit on apply and ok after that launch the game and see if it works if not click on disable full screen optimizations and hit on apply and ok and after that check if the problem is fixed or not next is to allow the game through firewall for that go to the windows search search for windows defender firewall now click on allow an app or feature after the click on change settings now here you need to search for the game if it's listed if not you need to click on add, allow another app then go to the browse section select your game application add it to the list over here after adding it select the game make sure both private and public boxes are ticked and then click on ok after this try to launch the game and see if it helps if not next is to install visual c++ files for that go to the link i have already provided in the description copy it and paste it in your browser after it opens go below and from here you can download the visual c++ files after downloading it install it and then try to launch the game and see if it helps to resolve the problem if not next is to update windows for that go to the windows search search for check for updates this will check if there is any update available you simply need to click on check for updates and once you update your windows now try to launch the game and see if it helps if not final solution is to reinstall mega bonk game for that go to steam under library section select your game right click on it click on manage then click on uninstall and then click on uninstall option finally after this your game will be removed from your pc once done restart your pc once after restarting launch steam and again re install mega bonk game and then try to play it and see if everything is working fine so that's all for now in this video thank you